In this video, we will demonstrate how to use our BioA SARS CoV-2 kit with the BioMeme Franklin Thermocycler. We will start with the preparation of the BioA SARS CoV-2 kit version 1.0. Before you start, remember to thaw all your reagents and spin down. Also, have your own PCR worksheet printed out according to the manual. In an empty 2ml tube, we are going to prepare a master mix for the qPCR reaction. First, transfer 22 microliters of PCR grade water from tube 6 into the empty 2ml tube. Next, transfer 40 microliters of 2x reaction mix from tube 2 into the 2ml tube. Then, transfer 4 microliters of primer probe mix from tube 1 into the 2ml tube. Next, transfer 2 microliters of reverse transcriptase from tube 3 into the 2ml tube. Lastly, transfer 2 microliters of internal control from tube 4 into the 2ml tube. Ensure that the mixture is properly mixed by pipetting up and down. In this reaction, we are doing two positive controls and one negative control using our own low-profile PCR tubes as an example. Firstly, we transfer 17.5 microliters of the prepared master mix to each PCR tube. Then, 2.5 microliters of PCR grade water from tube 6 is added to the PCR tube serving as the negative control. Two point five microliters of the positive control from tube five is added to each of the two PCR tubes serving as the positive control. Make sure to mix well by pipetting up and down. For this assay, we have to add in fifteen microliters of mineral oil to each of the PCR tubes to prevent evaporation of the solution. Cool. 
close the PCR lids tightly. Insert the PCR tubes into the Biomeme Franklin Thermocycler. On the mobile phone, open the Biomeme Go app. Turn on the Biomeme Franklin Thermocycler and switch on the Bluetooth. Connect the Thermocycler to the phone via Bluetooth found in the App Settings page. Ensure that the serial number matches the device found. Once connected, a blue blinking light will be seen on the thermocycler. Going back to the Biomeme Go app home screen, select Start Run. Press Select Test to input your own protocol. Select the number of PCR tubes inserted. Name each tube here. Select a folder to save the results in. As an example, we will save it in the test folder that was preset. You can set the GPS coordinates of where you are running the test at if required. The app will go through the steps with you again to double check. Follow through these steps. It is important to ensure that there are no bubbles at the bottom of the tubes. If you are using the Biomeme Go strips, do make sure that the flat side is facing upwards. Finally, press Start Run. The run has started and you can wait for your results.